here at uh, Fort Fisher today. This is two weekends after the week of 4th of July. Um, I personally don't care to come down here on 4th of July. Too many crazies out here on the beach. But uh, she's a floating. Let's see if we can get them. Oh, something hit it. Something's on it. I think it's a flounder, baby. Yeah, that's got to be a flounder. Oh yeah, gotta be a flounder, baby. Oh yeah. Come to Daddy Rab, Mr. Daddy Rab. That ain't a flounder. A dang burn bluefish, boys. Spit the hook. Decent bluefish. Come on, cuz. Don't bite Captain K Dog. I don't like it when you do that. Dang bluefish. There, cuz. Got a dang flounder, baby. Yep, that's a flounder. Hell yeah. Oops, come on. Got him. Lost, look at there. That's why you bring a net, fellas. That is why you bring a net. Check him out. Let's see what we got. Hold on, Daddy Rab. I'll let you do it. Oh, he's peeing. He's so mad, I caught him, he's peeing on me. Let's see what he measures. Ain't but about a 12 and a half. Twelve and a half flounder. Pretty fish though. Later cuz. Got him. Oh yeah, it's a nice one here. He's just stay down. This is a nice one here, baby. Yeah, he's a nice fish. He's a nice flounder. Gotcha, baby girl. What is up with the daddy rat? That's a nice one there. Got a good old hook set on him. You gotta cross these flounders' eyes because there's a lot of bone in his mouth right here. And if depending on how he hit, he's hooked, you got the dad gonna get him. Right. Here. Let's see what he measures. Let's see what the daddy ram measures. If it had been a flounder season, he'd have been a keeper. He's uh, about 15 and a half. 15 and a half, Mr. Flounder. Come on, dude. Throw out with throw out. God, he scared me. Well, that jerk shad ain't worth a crap. I always got to go back to my go-to bait, my gold four-inch swimming mullet. Normally, I use pearl white, but this here... Is swimming mullet blue ice. It's got a little bit of pearl and blue in it. If you can't catch nothing, this is my go to bait right here. Flounder love this when they bite it, they don't let go. So all you do is take it, get your little eighth ounce or quarter ounce jig head. Me personally, I use a quarter ounce. Put her in there, thread her on, just like that. Nice one, boys. Nice one. Uh, no, it ain't. Damn. Fat ass croaker. Fat a croaker. There, there. I think it's a flounder. Yeah, that's a flounder. That's a nice flounder there. Yeah, that's a nice one. He's swimming to me. He won't pull him. He didn't feel that big at first, but he's staying down. That's a nice flounder right there, baby. Yes, sir. Yeah, that's a nice one. Oh, yeah, that's a nice flounder. 
Hashtag shoot a mighty. Yes, sir, baby girl. Yeah, I got him good. Oh, yeah, he's hooked good, baby. You ain't coming out of that big old flounder pounder daddy rab from Cincinnati rab. What's up, cool? Glad to see you. Where'd you come from, big dog? That's a damn horse daddy right there, son. That's a that's probably my personal best flounder right there, fellas. That's part of my personal best flounder. Well, he's close. He's 20 and a almost 21. If you close close the mouth, he's 20, 20 and a half flounder. I ain't worried about that phone right now though. That is a freaking flounder, Jack. Yes, sir. Let's see if we get her back. Later, cuz. He gone. Yeah, baby. What we caught that fish on was a three inch white, pearl white, gulp shrimp with a quarter ounce jig head and a 20 pound leader line up to a 20 pound braid with a FG knot. I can't seem to bust a 20 and a half inch flounder mark. Looking for the 21 or 22 inch flounder, but a very nice flounder. Um, if y'all wouldn't mind, hit the like button and please consider subscribing to the channel. Um, help me out a lot. Got another one. Another flounder right back to back. Second cast after that big one. And here's another one. It ain't as big, but it's damn nice. Well, the other one probably eat this one, but this is the very next cast right after that one. Flounder must be moving in, baby. We just need September to get here and we keep our one flounder a day. Good hook set. Let's see what he measures. He peeing on me. 14 inch flounder. Got him. Got you, mother Frodo. Dang. That's a perfect hook set right there. Little baby butt. Look at that hook set. Check him out. Check him out. All right, cool. I'm gonna let you go. You're too small, and I can't keep you anyway. You in North Carolina, Daddy Rab. North Carolina don't don't let people like me keep you you gotta be a commercial dude to keep you this is what happens when you stay out here long enough you'll have to drag your kayak back and you may have to wait till the tide starts coming in been out here worse so i should be able to get back but got to walk old motor just is skipping across in the mud oh there we go we're gonna get out of here it was a really good day out here caught about five or six flounder lost one there at the end um when i was trolling on the way back it was another one kind of it was probably 18 or 20 inches i don't think it was big as the other one the 20 and a half inch when i landed earlier but it was a really nice flounder it was a good day all in all won't so bad won't too windy out here um but if y'all wouldn't mind please hit the like button and subscribe if you want to see more content like me out here fishing in the marshlands catching daggone redfish flounder trout can't be good guys be good at it